Hey, what's up guys? I'm Bomb25 back with another Pokemon trading card game online video. And we're waiting for our opponent to load up the game, is what it looks like. So, yeah. We're testing out my Coco Poison Blend deck. Kind of a spin-off on the drop of poison, but with Tapu Coco. Uh, I tested it out a couple times without recording. It's won about 80% of the matches. Let's call heads. Ooh, yeah, the luck of the Lucario. Yeah, let's go first. Not good. Lucario, you've forsaken us. Well, at least we didn't mulligan. Where our opponent's not taking an extra card. We do not want that. This deck can fall behind quickly. Done to continue. Let's see what kind of deck this is. Alright, starting out with a Broxish, I can see. Ultra Ball. Get rid of this and this. Throw down a We'll just start building up Coco on the bench. I think I'll do that instead of sending it into the active. And we can some more for our new hand. That works great. Ooh. Okay. Alright, alright. I'm gonna leave it at this for now. This should be pretty good. Vivid Charge. Yeah, Vivid Charge is about enough. You won't be doing damage for two more turns. Well, next turn, then the turn after he'll hit. So, one more turn, I guess. We get one free pass. Well, goodbye for the charge. Mm. Save that. We can save the pseudo Udo. Bunch of this Viper, just in case. And there we go. My opponent looks pretty stuck, so this might be an easy win. Ooh, Sophocles. Not the best card. You're discarding too. I mean, what do you have to ditch? I saw Primarina GX. If you're ditching a Primarina, you know your opponent's stuck. Ooh, he pulled out a Palkia though. Palkia Primarina blend. I have not seen that, but Aqua Turbo does look like it synergizes pretty well. Okay, can I just click? Thank you. Yeah, I mean. Bubble Beat and Aqua Turbo probably synergize pretty well. Primalkia. That's what we're calling it. Primalkia. Max Elixir. Let's see, can he pull it off? No. He cannot pull out the Max Elixir. Not pull it off nor pull it out. Vivid Charge again.
So I'm not drawn to that electric energy that we needed. Not the best. Yeah, I see. I see you have a poison barb ready. Get it. All right. I think we can just pass our turn for now. This deck really doesn't take the offensive that quickly. Um, just because it's it's more of a counter-attacking deck with the Toxapex to Viper combo. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. I have no idea what I'm doing. And it worked pretty well. Okay. Okay, can we pull off an energy? At one energy, one Tapu Coco. That would be great. No. No. No energy, no Tapu Coco. No. No. Alright, let's let's ditch Talon Flame and Wishful Baton for now. We can try and go for this. Let's go for this Rayquaza. Start building up a backup attacker and possibly getting a uh, turbo storm in case we get something knocked out how many we got in here we got our double colorless yeah turbo storm's not gonna do so good yet Alright. Knock out. And we should have played out our poison barb. Alright. We we're gonna try and dodge this double colorless right here. No double colorless. Hmm. What to do? I think we should just build up on Tapu Coco. Alright. This isn't looking too good for me. He's getting that Aqua Turbo Pearl Hurricane built up. You know, you know how it goes. You know how it goes with this Palkia. Max Elixiring again. Can he pull it off this time? There he goes. He did it. I'm such a bad commentator. I'm just not very enthusiastic when it is 11.30 at night. I'm recording this video kinda late. I'm not uploading it today for sure. Multi-switch. Oh, Pearl Hurricane. Be wonderful. You're gonna die. Can we pull off the electric energy? That would be good. Kind of need that right now. Electric energy. Ah, this works. Alright, so he'll take 30 from damage. Like poison damage. That'll leave him with 120 left. Alright, Sky High Claws will knock him out. Yeet! Do people still say got him? I'm not sure. I don't know. People I talk to say got him. I also hang out with weird people like generic. Yeah. Not, not the best. No, no offense, but... We're weird people, and we know it. At least I know it. I don't know if Generic knows. I mean, yeah, he literally has a video of a haunted keyboard as he likes to call it on his channel. So, I don't know. What tool did he just play? Bodybuilding. Is he gonna go for the... Lumen as a barrier, or the GX? Really, either works at this point, so... Ooh, he's gonna pass. Ooh. 
Ooh, should I sycamore? Too late, I'm sycamoring. That was an impulse move that I probably shouldn't have done. But I think it might pay off. No, not not how I thought it was, but it kind of paid off. Sky High Claws, yeah! Honestly, once Tapu Koko gets going, I can to stop. Like, I've gone up against a couple other Tapu Koko decks, and they've just... If I can't get it going, and I'm pretty much dead in the water. What's he ditching this time? Ooh. Another Primarina GX. So he's got two now, right? Two there. He's got the Alolan Ninetales Luminous Barrier. Let's see, what's he gonna go for? He's probably gonna try and evolve that Vulpix. If I know my Pokemon card game. Luminous Barrier. Alright, we're gonna have to start building something up. Not the best. That's got 150 HP. Yeah. Ooh, poison damage is gonna get the KO, possibly. Five turns of poison damage. Haha. Ha ha ha. Oh, I already have a tool. I'm smart. Um. What? N? Yeah, let's try and draw into a double colorless. It's not very likely, but it might happen. No. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna Coco. We're gonna move all of these. Then we can Max Potion. And we can just Poison Stall for the game. Did I already lose us a Viper? I feel like I did. Yeah, I did. Okay, I'm smart. All my games kind of have blended together. I've played, like... Played a lot. Mostly against Generic, though. Alright, let's just start building this up just in case he heals off that poison. One more turn if he doesn't heal it, that, that that nine tails is going down. I'm gonna take the victory. Woo, victory. I might just call this deck Palkia EX because that's the only real thing he's used. That Primarina hasn't come in handy. He's ditched both of them. Ooh. Rescue stretcher, what's he gonna go for? gonna pull that Palkia back out. I assume that's what he would do. That's what I would do. No, Alolan Sandshrew. Maybe he's gonna retreat. I'm sorry, I'm really bad at commentating. It's and he's gonna get that knocked out. I'm gonna surprise. This is why you never let poison damage rack up. That killed him in like five turns. Alright, now I can. I wanna super scoop up that, but he's not gonna kill it, so. Go ahead, close. I should have played Rainbow Energy last turn. If he gets something and knocks out my Coco, I'm gonna be mad because I could have saved it, but I didn't. Another E. This looks like just some sort of water type deck, but it, it functions pretty well. Well, I didn't. Why didn't you attach? Oh, okay. He's, he can't manually attach, I assume. Evo Soda. Ooh, he's gonna smash. Down. 
Assuming with Slash Rush first. Yep. That was bad. I should have saved my Coco. We're gonna try and scoop up this Coco for next turn. Yay. Get this poison bar back later. Just be done. If I can get this Coco back out, that prevents damage from evolution Pokemon, so that's not gonna help against my Coco. My opponent might actually deck out if he's Sycamores. <laughs> If able to knock out my toxic pack, I'm gonna cry. If this is getting to be a really close match. He's getting back that Pre-Marina GX. Let's see what happens. Alright, I think that's game. And Top and Thunder GX. <laughs> MVP Tapu Koko 640 damage dealt, two heads flipped. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up, like it, leave video suggestions, comments, anything down below. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.